Hey you guys, AK47 Master here, back with some more Pokemon Leaf Green. And on the last episode, we took on Zapdos, and uh, on the previous one, we took on Articuno. Now in this one, we are not going to take on Moltres. We're actually going to go back on course of where we're supposed to go, and we are going to be heading to Cinnabar Island, which is where you can pick up the next gym badge. Alright, and if you're wondering, it is right now it is 12... Um, 12, 10, 12, 20 p.m. And it's a Wednesday, so you're probably wondering, Hey, AK-47 Master, shouldn't you be in school? Well, you're right and you're wrong. I did have school today, but, um, had uh, an irritation in my face, which isn't as bad now, which is why I'm commentating this. So, you know, it's not horrible. Like, it's, I could deal with it. So, I decided just to come home, just to chill out, you know, make some commentary. Have a good time. Yeah, that type of stuff. You know. Alright, so right now we are in the Pokemon Mansion, which is technically the next man the next uh, dungeon. I don't know why I, I don't know why I can speak there. And what? I thought I set the switch. That thing should be unlocked. Oh well. Anyways. Um Excuse me, guys. Just sneeze there. And, uh... Ah, oh, that made me lose my track of my, my thought. Uh, so yeah, we're in the Pokemon Mansion. And the reason why we're in here is because we cannot enter the Cinnabar Gym just yet. Technically, we have to go down here to get a key to unlock the gym door. Because as it stands now, you technically can't go in there. So we're going to do that. We're going to get... We're going to look for that key. We're going to find it, guys. We're going to find it. And there's also a few um, items you could pick up along the way that I think it's you guys will find pretty useful. I would definitely find them useful myself. So let's go pick them up. So yeah, unlock that door, go over here, come around here, and pick up TM14 Blizzard. That is one of the important items that you can get in this, in this place, on this floor, nonetheless. There's another repel. I don't know why I'm using my repels. I have super repels. I might as well get rid of my old repels. I gotta go shopping again in this game. <laughs> Go on a big shopping spree. Get all the repels, potions, all the all the necessary items that I need. Alright, we're doing pretty good on timing because I do want to hit up the gym on this episode. At least, at least a little. And there's TM22 Solar Beam and we just got the secret key in the middle of that. So let's just dig out of here. Alright, now that we're done with that, we are going to be heading to, um, the Cinnabar Gym to take this place on. Alright, so basically this gym is mainly themed around quizzes, quizzing. And, um, I'll show you guys the Pokemon quiz. Alright, get it right and the door opens to the next room. Get it wrong and face the trainer. If you want to conserve your Pokemon for the gym, alright, here we go. Caterpie evolves into Metapod, of course. Alright, your <laughs> intelligence or something like that. Your ability of intelligence is like unbelievable. Oh my god. Here you have two trainers in this room. I don't really know why. Alright, then get it right. Uh, there are nine certified. No, there's eight. Of course there's not nine. Come on, I'm not stung. I'm not retarded. Speaking of that, <laughs> um, my drummer in my band, by the way, I had band practice yesterday. That's why I didn't record. Um. <laughs> so funny because there's this kid um, in his class that basically he's kind of like you know a little mental but it's so funny because he'll say to his teacher oh yeah uh, you gotta let me go to the bathroom I gotta take a shit <laughs> but he says it straight to the teacher and oh I failed no <laughs> I wasn't paying attention but like instead of t you know using the bathroom he gives himself a swirly he literally goes into the bathroom, dunks his head into the water, and he gives himself a swirly. I just find that, <laughs> I just find that hilarious. I don't know. I know, you know, he doesn't mean to do it. Well, I think he does, because he does it every single day in that specific class. So he acts as that specific teacher. <laughs> I don't know, I just find that so hilarious. Every time I think about that, I told it to my friend, and he found it hilarious. 
So yeah. Alright, here we have a Rapidash taking on the super nerd. And since we didn't get the question right, and I moved the camera, and I'm failing all over the place. Alright, Chuck Norris needs some, some training. So let's train this baby up. I'll probably take on, well, I'll obviously take on all the trainers offline. I'll train this in this gym. Then I'll just head back to um, Blaine to take him on. All right, I didn't. I, that really confused me. That was like a, a brain twister. Like you know, you have a tongue twister. That was a brain twister right there. I guess since we're getting closer to closer to brain, blame brain, that the questions are getting tougher. Nope, that's not even a t um, an actual move. That was easy. All right, so here's Blaine, and he has two quiz rooms in here. And if you see, notice this little picture. Guess what it is? It's a photo of Blaine and Mr. Fuji. And I apologize, guys, for that fail. Absolute fail. So, yeah. That was Blaine and Mr. Fuji. And Blaine is the guy we're going to be taking on next episode. So, before I drop this camera on my face... I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.